How can I still be missing? Oh, you're a Master Conjurer, are you? Ow. Alright, so you, you want to fight. You want to fight, huh? Let's go, Necromage. this? Is that what you want to do? That's clearly what you want to do, because I am apparently incapable of hurting you in any way. Get back here. I'm so sick of you right now. I am so sick of these people. Why can I not just... Why can I not just have nice things? You like that? You better like that. Because that's all you're getting. That's it. That's the whole kit and caboodle. That's all. God, I hope there's nothing else in there. Because I have... I am not amused. No, there's more in there. There's a whole other thing going on. Well, let's heal up. And go see what it is. Hello? Hello? Who is in here, please? Hello? Hello, please? Hello, please? Oh, hey, buddy. You're, uh, you're a skeleton. That's cool. That's fine. Goodbye. Goodbye. Amulet of RK increases your health. That's nice. I am all for amulets that increase your health. Hunting bow. Who needs that, really? Come on. Nobody needs hunting bow. Alright, so... It wasn't bandits, it was necromancers. I'll admit that took me by surprise. Now, can we get some grinding done in here? No, no we can't. No grinding to be done. Oh, we can do epic now. But we don't have any oracalcum ingots, of course. I swear to god, dog. There doesn't seem to be anywhere to actually mine oracalcum that I have found. But maybe I'm just not looking hard enough. That's entirely possible. Port Karstav... Oh, there's... Uh. I've gotten into another dungeon on my way to the Shrine of Azura. Alright. So that's what's down here. Bunch of stuff. More things. Oh, beef. Lovely. I remember that there's a bunch of plates here for, for various usage. Gods in Worship. I think we've read that one already. And, of course, we've read the Yellow Book of Riddles about five times. I did not want to pick that up, Barbus. You have... Oh, you've got your familiar staff again. Barbus, out of my way. Thank you. Actually, you didn't get out of my way, so not thank you. You stayed in my way. Well, there's a bunch of weaponry in here that we can uh, that we can check out later, probably. Maybe. Really, really, it goes all the way down here. Guess who does not feel like raiding a prison right now? That's right, it's me. I'm the guy who doesn't feel like raiding a prison. Good. Oh, dagger burning. 
And there's something else down there shooting at us. Why don't you take care of that, Lids? And, uh, and Dog, you do that. I'll be up here at this empty chest. And uh, looking at empty barrels, just because that's what I like to do. Oh, you got you got an arrow in the face. That's 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 fine. Did you enjoy getting an arrow in your face? I'm gonna eat this cooked beef. It's good. I'm gonna eat these gourds. No, I'm not. They only give you one one point. These potatoes, though. Finally, a use for potatoes and red apples. Excellent. Great. Good. Oh, I shouldn't be playing this right now because I'm really not in the mood anymore. But I'm down here. It's just like, well, what? I can steal this now from the people who keep trying to kill me. That's that's considered theft now. That's what you're telling me here. I guess that is what they are telling me because that seems to be the gist of it. So my time card. Darn card! There we go. Hey, swing, bada 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 bada, swing! Okay, so what? I don't understand the difference between the things I can steal and just take here. It doesn't, it's not making sense to me. But I'm not gonna worry about it. I'm just gonna come down here. I'm gonna unlock all these doors. Because I like I like locking things. I like unlocking things rather. And it will give my lock picking a bit of a boost. And who can say no to a lock picking boost? And there's a lovely bucket here. And a bench. And some dog meat. Love out, get out. Not again. Pathing of the, on these people is just this pathing is honestly sometimes shamefully bad. Like, why? Is it, did this say master? Oh dear. Yep, that said master alright. Yeah, that's definitely... It's definitely a master log. Okay. Alright, I'm gonna quick save here. And I am going to unlock this master lock. Because if it kills me, I am going to unlock it. Alright, so it's, it's telling me that it's over this way, I think. No, it's not telling me that it's over this way. It's just flying off at random. Oh, 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 okay. Alright, so... And you're going to start... Yeah, yeah, okay. Alright. So we had it almost. No, we didn't have it almost. Well, actually, we did have it almost, but now... Now I don't anymore. Now I'm, uh... Now I'm... Now I'm too far gone. Alright, so let's see here. No, alright. So it's not quite that far over, but it's close to being that far over. So let's just very, very slowly move this around. Very slowly. <sighs> no? Okay. Alright. So I got further away that time. Alright. And this time we can... No? Alright, so... A bit further over then? Alright, let's just softly, 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 softly. Softly, 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 softly. No. Softly, softly, softly. Oh yeah! Oh man! Who is the master lockpick? Remember back in episode 2 when I jokingly called myself a master lockpick and like 20 people disliked the video saying, How are you not a ma doing a master lockpick for real at this point early in the game? Where there aren't any master locks anywhere around and you're right at the beginning of the game, but you know, you said master lockpick and you just couldn't possibly be a joke. 
Yeah, well, now I am a master lockpick, so, you know, suck it. All you people who dislike that video, you can go and suck it. And I don't say that lightly. There's nothing in here. It's just, I guess, it's just practice. Face me with a master lock, and I unlocked it. And that just happened. That's just the thing that happened. These novice locks, no problem now. Up to 35 lock picking. Because I'm a master. I'm a lock picking master. I'm getting all the dog meat for it. See that? No problem at all. Boom. Just boom. Don't even need to think about it. Lydia, you get out of my way. I'm a, I'm a master lockpick now. I have the right of way. I hate you, Barbus. Anything in here? Just some potatoes. Nothing exciting. How about back here? Salt. Alright, let's go to Barbus. Alright, so is that, uh, was that everything down here? We done? Can we go and leave this place forever? And go back outside? Because I am eager to get back to work. I've been taking little breaks in between. Which, uh, you know, good for your health in addition to everything else. Alright, so... That's... I think that's where we came from. What was in here? Apples? Alright, or did we did we come from here or no, we haven't been here yet. Wood door. And there's a whole bunch of other stuff going on. Of course there's a whole bunch of other stuff going on. Oh, so that'll take us to Skyrim. And this door will What will it not take us to Skyrim? The one up here? Oh, we came down we came down out there. Alright. Cool. We'll just take we'll take this exit because we found it here. After I steal their potatoes and nothing from there because that barrel's empty. It's good that they've got lots of, of fingers here because then they can set up some great jokes, you know, they'll be like, Hey, can you give me a hand, uh, brother Necromage? And the other one can go, Sure thing, buddy, and they'll get into that like that box of hands and they'll just be like, Hey, High five! Well, let me give you a hand with that. These are real handy. I think I got my finger on the problem here. So, you know, thumbs up to that. I think we've... I think at this point we've managed to index all of the possible hand jokes. But if you can think of any more, feel free to palm them off on me here. And, uh, you know. Alright. Seriously, I'm done now. Seriously. Scout's Honor. Alright, that's the last one. And, uh, you know, if, uh, if it turns out that I'm lying, well, on the next video, you can be sure that you'll get a five-finger discount. Alright, seriously, I'm done now. Okay, is that was that the fort? Are we done the fort now? Are we finished? Or do we have to go still in the top here? We have to still go in the top here. Of course we do. All right, all right. Let's uh, quick save here and get in captain's quarters. The cast I have captain's quarters. I'm sure there's nothing weird in here. Nothing dangerous or weird going on here at the captain's cast out captain's quarters. Would you guys get out of my way? I've got serious work to do. I'm a I'm I'm a very important person. Apothecary satchel conjure frost atronach, that sounds handy. What do you got in your chest? Gold robes. How about in your dresser? Don't need that. Warrior. Hey, my block got increased. It's by Revan. I wonder if his first name was Darth. I gotta stop making these terrible jokes. But that's just charcoal? Is that like a... 
alchemy ingredient or something? I guess it must be. Out of the way. Is that another book? No, that's the satchel that I already checked. So that'll uh, open us out onto the roof. So let's save and uh, look down here and see what's going to attack us, if anything. Nothing, nothing's going to attack us here. What's in this chest? Gold and lockpicks. That's good, because I I need lockpicks badly after that amazing master lockpicking I did. Which, again, for those of you who were whining about uh, episode 2 and not using your critical thinking skills, Suck it! I'm a master lockpick now, for real. No sarcasm. I'm right, gonna take that. Of course, the vast majority of my viewers, uh, you are intelligent people who understand sarcasm, as evidenced by the fact that there are there is a mass there there are massively more uh, likes than dislikes on these videos. I've read this one. Like, massively more. Because uh, you guys are awesome. You're amazing. And I don't mean to include you in that... Uh, another mixed unit tactic. In that general uh, invitation to suck it. You are not welcome to do that. Uh, of course, this is all figurative language. Which, if I've you've taken... Any high school English courses you're familiar with? I am sworn to You are, so just burdens. shut up. Just shut up and take the stuff. You can't. You can't. Alright. Let's, uh... See what's up here. If anything. I'm sure it will be very interesting. We are on a roof. I'm always happy to be on a roof, because that way you get a good view of the surrounding... Whoa! Looks like some human sacrifice was going on up here. Oh, scroll of Conjure Familiar. And a steel dagger, always, uh, always good. Oh, nightshade. Alright, so you had a pine thrush egg in you and some, some bloody gold. And lids, why don't you, do you uh, grab that bloody dagger? Just in case, you know, it's, it's tainted. Okay, got it. With anything. Anything Good. else? No, I think that about covers it. I think we're about covered here. So I'm just gonna save and then jump off a building. Because that's the safest way to do things. Now, we need to figure out how to get up here. So I guess we continue this way. And head on out, and then we are going to make our way up the road. I think we have to go up here, get around, and then eventually we will uh, swing around on the road to go up the mountain. Yes, eventually. That would be super cool if we could do that, because then we would, you know, be on our way to our actual goal, as opposed to wandering through the trackless northern wastes. I mentioned that winter environments in video games are my least favorite things. Not because I don't like winter. I am quite fond of winter in places where winter genuinely exists. <laughs> Dang. Hello. But, uh, you know, places like here in Vancouver, where winter just means it rains more. Not so much. And in video games, where it just means lots and lots of white and black textures, also not so much. Even if the textures are very nice and fairly uh, highly detailed. Alright, are we on the right track at all? Alright, yes, we are. Just around the corner. Just around the river bend. Right? You promised me, bro. You promised me we were almost there. We were going to be able to swing around. That does not look like a road. That does not look like a road. There's a road on the map, but it's not a road here. 
Man, I, I'm not, I'm not going into a cave right now. I just came out of like 30 dungeons. Hey, look, a cave. Wonder what's inside. I don't care. Come back to it later. I want to go to Azura's shrine. That is where I want to go. I don't want to go anywhere else. Oh, a garnet. I just want to go to the shrine. I've been trying to get there for like 10 episodes now. I've got to stop exploring. I've got to stop. Alright. How am I going to get up here? Alright, can we... Okay, so we still have to move around over to here. Still have to move around a bit before the road comes up, I guess. Sorry, I'll go third person for you. I know how much you guys like that. Oh, wolves. <laughs> Anyone else? Hmm? Hmm? Anyone else want to try that? I didn't think so. Alright, there we go. That looks like a path up. Perfect. Let's quick save before anything else happens. Wow, there's like a castle up there. And I think there's a mine like right here. And there's definitely a dude walking along up there. Let's go say hi to this dude. 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 Hey, dude. Hello? Now I remember. You're that new member of the Companions. So you... what? Fetch the mead? In a manner of speaking. Alright, so there's a mine here. It's good to know. But, we're gonna get up this mountain, if it kills me, which is very... Holy texture glitch, Batman. Alright, we're gonna get up here. Oh, I stopped running in time. I hate it when it does that. Okay. And... Wow. Definitely something going bad with the textures out here in the north. Maybe this is an issue that was fixed in patch 1.2, but I had to remove patch 1.2 in order to use any of my mods. And I quite like my mods. I very much like my mods. Ah, oh, so these are rocks. I thought for a second these were caves. But no. No, they're, they're rocks. Oh, hi. Hello. Yo! bear. Alright, let's uh... These bears are... I have contracted break fever? What the hell is that? No soul gem large enough for this bear? Okay, I don't know what soul gem fever is, but... I guess I have it. Old bone break fever. I wonder if that's like cat scratch fever. It'd be kind of neat if it was like cat scratch fever and then it like teaches you about feline and I don't know. I don't know what I'm talking about. Uh, fortunately, I have on me a potion of cure disease. There we go. And that should be that for bone break fever. Ideally, that would be that at least. An empty goat. What a shame. Are we almost at Azura's shrine? It looks like this may be it. It looks like we may almost have made it finally to Azura's. There we are. Oh my God, guys! Finally, after like I don't even know, I don't even know like 80 episodes now, Azura's shrine. Wow. I can't believe it took that long to get here. But it did. And now we're here. And now that we've taken this iron, we're going to go over to the shrine. We're going to say hi to the shrine. We're not going to kill that bunny in case Azura is not big on bunny killing. We are going to quick save, though. And here we are, class, at last. 
after braving bears, draugr, and blood dragons, and caves, and all this shit, finally made it to Azura's shrine. And I am so happy about it. And I'm going to stand here, looking at it, for five hours, so that we can see it in the sunlight. Gorgeous. We finally made it, Lids. We finally made it. Did Barbus make it too, or is... Ah, who gives a shit about Barbus? Nobody does! Nobody cares about Barbus. We're here, Azura's Shrine. I don't really know what to do here, but we'll figure something out. I'm gonna go to bed, and I'll play this sometime. It's gonna be crazy coming up with uh, finals and report cards and trying to find a new job, along with all the other teachers. So until the next time, all the best.